going to show you real quick a different variation. Uh, a lot of people love this at the restaurant, and, and an easy way to do it at home is if you're having some friends over is to do an appetizer party and make your waffles, but instead of cooking, serving a plate to each person, what we do is we make little bite size. What we like to do is take little bite sized portions of the pulled chicken on top. You can really uh, wow your guests the next time they come over your house with a little chicken and waffle bite size. And then we put a little bit of butter on top of each one. And then you can drizzle just a little bit of fresh maple on top just to make sure you get that extra little sweetness when you serve it to your friends. This pulled chicken is uh, chicken quesadillas. Uh, my kids love them. We take this pulled chicken meat and a flour tortilla and put the little bit of cheese and the chicken and uh, saute them up and crisp them and the, the kids love it. It's just a great way to uh, utilize uh, the Grigstown chicken. What we've done is where we've crisped up the chicken and we've sauteed some mushrooms and made a uh, reduction of that chicken stock. We've re reduced it down to make a, a gloss so it's very concentrated. Put a little bit of that in here and a touch of cream and then a little bit of Parmesan cheese and some pasta. It's a great, great dish. Griggstown Chicken Channel. Griggstown Chicken Channel.